Hello everybody, Sai here again. Not Sai Perp. Sorry, I forgot my new name. And um we're gonna talk about the Spock just stuff again, cause um seems that a new thing has come out that where Spock is not proven innocent. Now I downloaded PK Russell's stuff on this. So I downloaded all the pictures, screenshots of the conversations, right? And I will be leaving, hope, yeah, I'll be leaving a link to it as well. And basically, so, as my understanding goes, here's the story. Stories and Pentagon decided, you know, let's take down Spock or over whatever reason. I believe, if I remember correctly from the video, also no script. If I remember correctly, here's how it went. So, Pentagon. Spock did believe in a video about about just a robot, I believe his name is. And Spock said, you know, he agrees that he doesn't think that story is really ape. Pentagon got triggered about this and all that, right? And they and them and stories devised this plan to incriminate Spock and gather evidence. They grew I think they groomed the Tari into it as Digbert the goat. As Digby the goat, can I suggest? I suspect Ghosty after all of it. I believe Ghosty. I believe here's what happened. So Ghosty claims to be part of it. I think Ghosty was just another girlfriend of Spockers, right? And what happened is that Ghosty was groomed into it by them. Like, with the promise, like, all right, all right, you do this, man, and you're, you will catch, like, wildfire, let me tell you, buddy. You, you will be rivaling Spockers. You will be the new Spockers in terms of drivers, right? And... Because Ghosty seems, they seem awfully, like, weird about it. I noticed in the video, they acted a lot awkward. Like, they, I'm going to be honest, they sounded like they had a gun to their head. As an exaggeration, obviously, but they sound like guns to their head right now. Um, I don't know, in Atari's text, they don't really, I'm actually going through them right now, so if you hear, like, little tapping, that's me and my keyboard. And um, I'm checking through Atari's number now. I don't know if I can, I don't know if she's really that incriminated too much. Because Pentagon up and left, stories up and left, God knows where, God knows where stories went. I think Pentagon came back and left again after P.K. Russell's thing. Of course, P.K. Russell and, um, other person. Claps to you guys for thinking all this. Because, um, like a lot of people, I was kind of first believing, just didn't really look into it. Of course, you know, well, we're all lazy people at heart, I believe. So, like, as I'm reading this now, I can't really find much to incriminate her. Like, yeah, there's not really much to incriminate her. Just to, all I'm seeing here is that like they're just calling Digby a jerk, pretty much. And that's all that's happening. And. <sighs> There's not really much to incriminate Atari. I mean, of course. Anyway, so like, sorry, I accidentally cut my recording there. And um, yeah, if you now hear start hearing clicking, yeah, Pentagon. You know she's been incriminated to the moon and back. I mean, I swear to God, there's infinite amounts of. There's infinite amounts of screenshots on here. Like, he wasn't kidding when they said there's a lot. Like, good God, is there a lot? Oh yeah, Ponder Spock. Yeah, Ponder Spock is the other person I was thinking of. So like, they're very. Ponder Spock is kind of. You know, Ponder Spock is nice, but why am I talking about Ponder Spock all of a sudden? <laughs> And, um, the argument that Spockter, um, like, admitted to it, I mean, yeah, there's a difference going on. I get what they're saying. Like, if you admit to the crime, you're obviously going to get with less hate of defending yourself, because everyone's kind of at blister, like, oh, he did it. Well, whoopsie-doo. We hate, we hate him now, and all that, like, yeah. And, yeah, that's pretty much what we got. And stories, stories, I, I think out of the two, I think I hold stories depending on both this new low level. 
Like, I think I got a lot more reasons to hate stories. I just kind of hate Better Girls because they kind of started this all and all that. I don't know why I guess it's important, but. Meh. And this. Stories is kind of. I think stories is. The episodes are dumb. They're definitely stupid, but. You know, they did devise a plan. Stories lied about their age. And I don't know about you, but I don't think they lied about just for this, but. They use their age against, like, a 16, 17-year-old to incriminate him of, like, predatory evacuation. That's not a good thing to do. I did I did notice a lot of red herrings, kind of, to signify that they're older. Like, in one video, they said um, they learned about sex in a radio, in one video. And I was like, wait, an 8-year-old learned about sex on a radio? Seems kind of suspicious, because I think either the parent parents slash parents would be a bit more mindful of the radio then or at least try to explain but no there's no indication of any of that so it just seems to be yeah just um stories lied about the rage to incriminate spockner not to incriminate Spockner, but they used their fake age to incriminate spockner pentagreen had some stupid grudge that they, and even in some screenshots, they're like, so you frame Spockter. Which is, people say like, people say like, you don't see what's behind that, and all that, but the fact that someone, I'm gonna show screenshots in the video now, editing, that's probably Jesus, spider on my computer. There's a, they say, there's people who go say screenshots, I bet someone's gonna say, but you know, it's before that, so they, they could not be true and all that. Who's ever seen like Pentagon stores at this point, which I doubt was like that one redneck in the corner. And I would think, that, like, yeah, you don't really see what's behind that, but the fact that someone is even suspicious in a chat, that someone frames Fox, the fact that they're able to put that together in their head, I think counts as like a slither of evidence. Like, flimsy one, but slither, kind of. And there's a lot of screenshots of other ones, right? And I swear to God, when I open Spockler's file on um, the whip, like, screenshots pond their scroll, I swear to God, man. I don't think anyone can actually comb through this all, like, like, in an hour. Like, if you can, I really want to see, like, this sped-up video of someone, like, putting their mouse under it, like, actually reading at a human pace. But all I really need to know from the things I'm pretty sure is just the names. I can't come through these all with that. I'm pretty sure the amount of evidence that they, like, that they dug up is crazy to the amounts, right? And it's very, very crazy how much they dug up. I'm just repeating myself now, but since I'm just repeating myself now, that's the end of the video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, and uh, hope you enjoyed this long-winded video where I my recording cut out halfway, and uh, see you guys later.